Fuck all these niggas and bitches, they dead to me I got the sauce, I got the remedy Say you my dog, but act like an enemy I make a call and turn you to Kennedy Not wasting my time, not wasting my energy Shot for my confidence, shot for a better man So with the NBA track like coming up There are a lot of NBA teams that are looking to make a lot, a lot of big moves For a trade deadline But there are five particular teams that are desperately need to make a move now in my opinion so that's exactly what we're going to be talking about in this video what's good y'all it's your boy will we're back in your know the video so the five teams i'm going getting straight to it desperately now don't get wrong there's teams out there that suck they all suck there's a lot of teams out there that suck but honestly shouldn't really make a move because they have to just wait, wait until the, the lottery, wait until the, the draft comes around, and then make y'all piss in. There's no need to make make moves now. Those the teams I'ma say that suck that don't need to make moves: Detroit, Spurs, Wizards, um, Memphis, the Grizzlies. Those teams they don't need to make moves. Okay. One reason, Grizzlies. It's y'all just had bad luck this year, honestly. You know, with John Morant having a suspension, him coming back and making a mess of himself, and then getting injured in a season injury, season ending so shoulder injury. Then next couple of games after that, Marcus Smart got a a broken pinky finger. He's out for eight weeks. Then another injury in Desmond Bain. So you'll have nobody. Wait till next year. Wait till next year. Everybody should be coming back. Okay. Memphis should be fine. And y'all can get a good pick in the in the draft. San Antonio. I got Wimby. Build around him. Right? Y'all got good young players around him. Keep building around him. Y'all gonna be another y'all gonna get another really good pick in the draft. Detroit. I actually like the trade y'all did. Because Isaiah Livers is trash. Y'all needed him, y'all needed him off the team. He's trash. Okay. That's a the best sign y'all had. And y'all just won a game against the Washington Wizards, right? So, Detroit. I know those look terrible, right? Keep your team intact for now. Okay. In the offseason, try to move Boban. Okay. A, a bot die. Get some help. Get rid of all the sins y'all got on that team. Marvin Bagley, Isaiah Stewart, Jalen Duran. Keep Jalen Duran. Marvin Bagley and Isaiah Stewart. Y'all need to move one of those. Y'all got too many sinners. Build around Cade Wright. Coaching, I don't know about Monty Williams, okay? But Detroit, be, just be patient, okay? It looks terrible right now. I think y'all be fine this year. Hopefully. Now, let's get to the five teams that need to desperately make a trade. And I'm going to tell why they need I'm, I'm going to explain why and who. Who they need to trade for. Now, obviously, let's let's be honest. Three of these five teams are going after Pascal Siakam. They are in the Pascal Siakam sweet stakes. But it's one team that's going to make that trade for him. Right? So, the first team I'm starting off that needs desperately need to make a trade. Atlanta Hawks. I mean, like, let's be honest. The Atlanta Hawks, they, I don't know how to explain them. That, that's how they are, okay? Trey Young obviously needs help. The problem is, DeAndre, hurt, DeAndre Hunter is still hurt, okay? And it's, everybody's trying to go into DeJounte Murray, especially the Lakers. So, I was watching earlier, I was watching Kenny Beecham's video. And shout out to Kenny. I love watching. He's one of my favorite create country creators to watch. Uh, and he was doing a 2K rebuild, you know, trading every player on the Atlanta Hawks except for Trayon and Jalen Johnson. So the trades he made, in my opinion, they're a little questionable. I feel like him getting Vucevic is okay, right? Good scoring big. Can get rebounds, you know, but. Doesn't play defense. 
at all. Doesn't play any kind of defense. Yes, he can spread the floor, but I don't think Trey Young needs a big that gets rebounds occasionally and doesn't play any kind of defense. I think Trey Young, in my opinion, I think Kenny should have got Andre Drummond. But a low. I honestly, for real, I think they he should have got Andre Drummond. I think that's what the Hawks should get instead of Vucevic. Now let's talk about the whole trade in total, what they should do. Let's be honest. They're not gonna get Siakam. Clear it out. You know why they're not gonna get Siakam? The Raptors don't need Jajaj Murray. They don't. They got IQ with RJ Berry. Building around Scottie Barnes. Have Schroeder. Oh, okay. Still have Portal. The Hawks at this point. I'm being realistic. Yes, the Hawks need Siakam. Okay? But what I just said, getting Andre Drummond can benefit them as rebounding the ball more and playing better defense. But without having Siakam, this is the second best option they can do. Zach Levine. Zach Levine. It can help out Trey. This is the only reason I'm saying this. Zach Levine is a scorer. DeJounte Murray was supposed to be a defensive anchor with the Hawks. Didn't pan out to be. So at this point, the Hawks don't, doesn't look like they, they want to have somebody playing defense. Okay, They don't look they looks like they can't get a 3 and D guy. Yet another bucket getter with Trey. Okay? Get another bucket getter with Trey. And then get a big like Andre Drummond that's going to rebound the ball. Unfortunately, can't move De DeAndre Hunter right now. That's the that's the downside. But if y'all trying to trade DeAndre Murray, I feel like getting Zach Levine would be better than getting Austin Reeves, Rui Hashimura. In my opinion, I might be wrong. I, I like Austin Reeves, okay? I like Rui Hashimura. But a consistent bucket getter. At this point, is what the Hawks need. They can't, I mean, defensive-wise, Archer Reeves doesn't bring that much defense, and Real Hearts from Mercer doesn't bring that much defense. It's the same thing as Zach Levine. It's not going to be like, I think Zach Levine will bring more offense and bring less pressure off of Trey Young, and then adding a big with that in that scenario would be better. That's my opinion on the Hawks. That's really the only trade I can do. Can't get Seattle. Sorry. They don't want you. All right, second team. I'm going to fast forward this video, okay? Second team. Sacramento Kings. Here's why. Yes, Sacramento's good, but they're missing a piece. Siakam. Now, this is a team that has a lot better chance of getting Siakam than the Atlanta Hawks. Right? They try to do Harrison Barnes, Cameron Herter, and company and a couple pits to get him. Maybe. Maybe it'll happen. I don't. I just don't see the Raptors doing that deal. I just don't see it. But it can happen. Right? So, if that, if that, if Sacramento gets Siakam, look out in the West. Sacramento's already good. But they, that's their missing piece. Third team, Warriors. Who would say Warriors? Same thing. Like I said, I said Siakam's in sweet states for three teams. In my opinion, the Warriors be the perfect fit for Siakam. Perfect. I think this will be the best fit other than the Dallas Mavericks. In my, my opinion, Dallas Mavericks will be the best fit. But if we're talking about these five teams, the Warriors is the best fit for Siakam. This is what the Warriors are missing. Period. It's Siakam. And they have the best asset to trade away. Kaminga. Will they straight Clay Thompson away? I don't see them doing that, but I won't be the surprise. I kind of would. I mean, Clay Thompson is so much to that to that organization. I don't see them doing that, but I can see them trading away Kaminga. They might. They gonna keep. They they'll keep Draymond, but they. Yeah. It'll be Kaminga, maybe 
Kavon Looney, and they're going to try to get Porter in that deal and get the Siakam and a couple picks. Warriors can get that done. Okay. Fourth team. Y'all going to be surprised by this one. Phoenix Suns. And I've been saying this before they got KD, before they got Bradley Bill. Okay. They need a point guard. That's what they've been seeing. Devin Booker could play the position. Cool. KD could play the position. Cool. Bradley Bill could play the position. Cool. Not if y'all want to get far in the playoffs. Not if y'all want to win a championship. You need a point guard. And the best option, get Ty Jones. Package. What's his name? Uh, good, uh, I don't believe how good one. I forgot his name. Package one of y'all guards. All right. Package him up. Maybe package Josh Okoge. I know y'all want to keep him. But him or one of y'all guards y'all have. Keep Grayson Allen. Keep Bobo. Keep Tyus Jones. Tyus Jones is one of the most underrated guards in the league. It's because he's on the Wizards. He can do a lot of things. And he's a great playmaker. You get Tyus Jones... Look out in the West. Y'all going to be ready to hoop. Which y'all are proving lately, but y'all going to be really ready to hoop. And the last team. Y'all know what I'm going to say. The LA Lakers, okay? This is one team, they're not going to get Siakam. So I'm not going to say Siakam. They're trying their best to get Jadache Murray, okay? So, honestly... I don't like the Zach Levine fit on this team. So, yeah, Jajante Murray is probably the best fit for them. So, you want to have to package Austin Reeves, Rui Hashimura, and probably Tyrion Prince in a, in a pick to get Jajante Murray. And then probably you can try to finesse and get Bada. But they're not going to get rid of Bada. But you can try to finesse and try it. Or Sadiq Bay. So, you can package Austin Reeves. Roger Murray, Terry on Pritz, you get Jajanshi Murray, and Sadiq Bay. Is that a good deal? My opinion, no. But that's the best option. The reason why I don't think it's a good deal. Okay, Lakers, y'all need to keep the best ability, the best ability y'all need to do is keep Austin Reeves. If y'all can package Roger Murray, Terry on Prince, Cam Raiders, and all them. And get Jonathan and Murray, that'll be a steal. But that's not gonna happen. They're gonna want Austin Reeves. So Lakers. I don't like Zach Levine fit for y'all. See, Occam's not going to Lakers. It's y'all best option. So I understand why y'all try to get Jonathan Murray. Y'all do need a guard, y'all need guard play. So yeah. Lakers. Try. Keep trying it. Hopefully y'all pull it off. And that's all the fans video. If y'all enjoyed, give your boy a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below the teams y'all think needs to make moves. And comment down below these traits, these straight options. And let me know down in the comments your opinions. And get back to me. Share this video with friends and family out there. And give me to a thousand subscribers. I appreciate y'all tuning in for this video. It's your boy, Will, and I'm out.